Okay. Good day, morning. I don't know. Day five. Day five. And we're going to Billings, Montana. It's uh, I, well, the way we're gonna go is a little more scenic, so it's almost a six-hour uh, right. lake. Yeah, trying to stay off Highway 90 and take yeah. Highway 12. Yep. Um, I guess you know it's good for you to know, but you'll know tomorrow. We're yeah, we'll tell you if that worked or not. <laughs> um, we'll, and we'll yeah, there's, yeah, and there's a few breweries there uh, right around where we're staying. I'm hoping the hotel is better. And yeah, we found a cool uh, gentrified part of Missoula <laughs> to, with some river trails to take a walk in this morning. So yay, because I think we had, you know, 3,000 calories yesterday. Plus. So, you know, who's counting? Okay, we're on the road to Billings now. Um, we've done a much better job of planning this trip and trying to stay off the major highways. So you, you have to take 90 to get to get out of um, Missoula. Where were we? <laughs> Missoula. <laughs> and um, and so now we've just made the turn onto 12. We're going to go through Helena, state capital, wind our way over to Billings. Um, there are some breweries along the way. Um, but I think we're probably just gonna blow right by them because there's a couple of weird things about going to breweries in Montana. Uh, the first are these little cards they give you. Each person is only allowed to have four beers from any particular it establishment it per day. Maybe this four. 48, uh, 48 ounces per yeah. person per day per brewery so you get everybody has a little different way of doing it but most of them have this little card they give you and they check you off and that's and then you're out of beers um, and the other thing is they don't serve after 8 p.m. so we've got a long drive today to get yeah. there when we get there we've got three breweries right around the hotel we're staying that we want to go to we're gonna go to uh, Montana Brewing Company yep. uh, and then probably uh, Uber uh -huh. brew and uh, one called the Garage at Yellowstone Valley Brewery. Um, so we're gonna pull the town around 35 and we wanna make sure we hit all those, so we're gonna sacrifice a few along the road to do that. Yep. So in this one, have more beers. Yeah. Yes. Think, yeah. On your part. Our research is paying off. So we avoided. I I remember I read some blog on like how to avoid major highways on a road trip, and then a lot of blogs on scenic byways and those kinds of things. So we took 12 today instead of 90, added a half hour, but a mellow, stunning, beautiful drive. Yeah. It was something else. Like one epic, like <laughs> breathtaking <laughs> view after another. And now we're starving because we've been living on popcorn and La Croix. Yes. So we're in Billings. And, and we're going to go to Montana Brewing first yeah. and get some more pub food <laughs> and some beer. It's been two days since we had pub food. I think it was last night. Oh, we had Thai last night. Oh, yeah. we're good. We're good. Yay. <laughs> So we just went to two breweries in Billings. One was Montana Brewing Company, which has been around since 1994. Had a really good golden ale there and a good huckleberry that was kind of refreshing and delicious. It was better than the other huckleberry that Yeah, way better. Um, I had a pale, 
It was good. It had kind of a weird flat bitterness at the end, but it was, it was pretty good pale. But the the amber, there's nothing amber about it. It was a really good red ale. It was yeah. Really roasty, really dark, beautiful. But I don't know why they call it an amber. And we had some but, decent pub food and a really awesome service. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, it was good. It was good. It was good. It was good and stuff. now we're at um, Uber Brew. There it is. Uh, there it is. <laughs> and um, just had a flight there, um, and their double IPA, which is called. Humulus <laughs> ludicrous. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> it was really good. Yeah. Seven hops. I mean, there was so much hops you could do with a fork. It yeah. was really good. Um, and there are other beers. Yeah, hop forward, good. A lot of grapefruit in the IPAs and stuff. Yeah. But um, it was, it they're was good. They're a new. Did you start to say this? They were a newer no, brewery? No, they were around years like, ago. like 2012. Yeah. yeah. Um, but um, not quite our cool. spot. Like, yeah. you know, but, but yeah. good. So we're heading to the next service. place yeah. around the corner. Um, that's the Which I'm sure the beers will just get better. <laughs> they, they usually do. Okay. Um, this is the uh, cabin at Yellowstone. Uh, I don't know. We'll say it once we get there. Yeah. Facebook page for updates. Well, that didn't work out. They're, they're closed. They're closed. <laughs> going to, we think Carter's. Brewery. Something like that. We pass it on the way. We're going there next. his favorite time. What? Sponsored beer? Ah! Okay, so uh, these beers are sponsored by Eric Jeffrey. I'm that guy. He's a cool guy. Um, Eric, I'm drinking a Mason, the best bitter. It's so good. We're at um, Carter's Brewery. In uh, Billings, Montana. Montana. And I'm yeah. having their Iron Bender IPA, their flagship. And it's good. Yeah, very it is good. good. It's um, very balanced, very nice. So, for those of you who don't know Eric Jeffries and Solar Estates, um, we're going to put a link yeah. to their yeah. amazing music uh, because stuff. they're not all bad. And I think they're recording a new, some new songs, new something. I saw things happening on Instagrammies and things. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, thanks so much, Eric. It's very sweet of you. Thank you so much. Cheers. Cheers. All right, we're at Carter's Brewery now. We just went to um, this asylum distillery. Uh, down the street. You know, there's a chalkboard out on the street that says distillery this way. Okay. Detour. Detour. And um, we tried their gin, which I thought was really good. I thought it was um, a hot. I still thought it was good. Drinkable. And then they had a root beer moonshine. They had all kinds of moonshines. We ended up with the lemonade moonshine that is so good that we're drinking it around the campfire tomorrow. That's the plan. Yeah. So Carter's here is good. Uh, Beer's been solid. Yeah. Um, Cool hangout. Too bad everything closes at eight. You know the weird thing is, we just talked about those little tag things you get, and they mark off the beers. We haven't seen that today, so we yeah. don't know if that's uh, something. They still have to stop serving beer at eight, which is weird. So I don't. Yeah, but anyway, there, I had their bitter. There are rules. Uh, kind of, uh, what I have? Yeah, I had their their bitter, and it was smooth and malty and really good. And you had yep. right. Okay. Like, yeah. yeah. It's really good. Yep. And so, so I think that's all. So that was sweet. Tried to go to another place that was closed. Yep. And, and uh, they stopped serving in um, 30 minutes, so I think we're good. That's it for Billings. Um... Okay, so this has happened to me twice now. Okay. We just made a gas stop, dropped my phone in my pocket, Google Maps is still on. Going to use the restroom, standing there by myself, as you would, and all of a sudden she says, turn left on North Avenue. <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's like turn by turn directions with a side of heart attack. 